What's good, honey boo boos? Make sure y'all go and subscribe to my YouTube channel because I want to bring more to y'all. And I got something waiting for y'all. This is MUA Shea. Welcome to my YouTube channel. And I'm going to be showing you guys this look on how I did it and how I turned my fail into a succeed. So just stay in tuned and make sure you also watch my other makeup palette reviews like the Tarte palette one and the Huda palette review so yeah on this new eyeshadow palette called the soft glam by Anastasia Beverly Hills took a little swig of this little makeup palette the other day because I just wanted to test it out and these are the colors So first, I'm going to start with a blending brush, and I'm going to be applying orange soda all in my crease and over the lid. Next, I'm going to be getting a flat brush and applying tempera into my brow bone, just like that. Just to kind of make it pop. Then I'm going to be using the brush that especially came with the kit because I feel like sometimes you just need to do that. So let's go and use this one pigment called Sienna and lightly apply it right on the corners and small circles. So I'm going to cheat just a little bit by using this Glimmer Reveal Kat Von D lip gloss slash matte lipstick type thing because I just got an idea and sometimes I just be having it.
so yeah this is how it looks on my skin and the reason why I do not like to use this as a lipstick because it's so light Then we can use this color called Fairy. It's like a little sparkly color. And just apply this right here. I did not know it was gonna be so pigmented, like boom. Yep, that's that's there, man. That's that's really good. You know what, we're just gonna turn it into, you know, just blend it out. That's what we're gonna do. This came out a lot better on my head than it did, you know, out on camera, but we're gonna work with it. We're gonna work with it. Yeah. All right, so the best thing about this, I'm gonna slide this eyeliner and it's gonna make this thing just look even way better. Cause that, that'd be the thing about makeup. And you can have some shitty ass eyeshadow and you can make some slay ass eyeliner and it just makes it all come together. So we're just gonna see, hmm, maybe I could fuck up the um, eyeshadow even more by doing this. Yeah, let's fuck it up even more. Let's do that. Then I'm going to be using this True Match. Not really too picky. I'm not really too picky about my foundations anymore. I really don't wear as much. This is the No Mistake Foundation Concealer Stick by Sephora. And it's a Mahogany 15. I'm going to use this to contour my face. 
Now, the reason why I like using darker shades because you can use a little bit and it just goes a long way. But you have to be careful with it and know what you're doing. This right here is my Becca Highlighting and Contour Kit. If you want to see a review on it, I do have those two. I'm going to be going with this medium and also mixing it with the blush. And then using the bigger side of my contour brush and getting the light and a little bit of the medium to just lightly apply over my brows and my forehead just to balance things out. For my setting powder, I'm going to be using this Kat Von D Locket Powder. I'm going to apply this right here. Now, I don't want it to be sharp and dramatic. That's why I didn't go like that. And just leave it there, then brush it off. I just want to put a little bit, just enough to lighten it up a little. Just enough to lighten it up. And I'm going to apply a little bit under my eyes. Now for my lipstick, before I put on any matte lipstick, I'm going to be using this coconut oil. This right here is Lingerie by NYX. It doesn't say what color, but it's a nude color. the hologram kit from Sephora and I'm going to be using the pink along with using a blending brush or a stippling brush also going to be using a little bit of the pink and the blue on my lip so they don't look so plain, but they also don't take away the look from the eyes. So I don't know if you could see, but my lips, they're pink, but they also have a blue hue to it. 